Hello folks! Welcome back to WIF Facts, and for today's video, we will talk about animals who have more than one heart. Yes, you heard it right, more than one heart. And be sure to watch until the end of the video for some extra juicy bits of information. The heart is a vital organ located in the chest that's responsible for pumping blood throughout the body. It is roughly the size of a fist and is composed of four chambers, the right and left atria and the right and left ventricles. Blood enters the right atrium from the body and is pumped into the right ventricle, which subsequently pumps the blood to the lungs for oxygenation. After returning to the left atrium, the left ventricle pumps the oxygen-rich blood into it before distributing it to the rest of the body. So now, which animals do you think have more than one heart? Can you guess how many hearts this animal has? The animals with three hearts are the octopus, squid, and cuttlefish. Octopuses are one of the best-known animals with multiple hearts. They are considered ninjas of the ocean. These soft-bodied, eight-limbed mollusks are part of the cephalopoda family, which also includes squids and cuttlefish. With their beaked mouth at the center of their eight arms, they can squeeze through small gaps and radically alter their shape. They swim by trailing their appendages behind them and use their siphon for both respiration and locomotion by expelling a jet of water. Octopuses are pretty smart for invertebrates, with a complex nervous system and excellent eyesight. They can be found in various regions of the ocean, including coral reefs, pelagic waters, and the seabed. And they have a few tricks up their sleeves, if they had sleeves, that is, to defend against predators. These include the expulsion of ink, camouflage and threat displays, and the ability to jet quickly through the water and hide. Some are even known to use deception. When it comes to reproduction, things can get a bit weird. In most species, the male uses a specially adapted arm to deliver a bundle of sperm directly into the female's mantle cavity. After this, he becomes senescent and dies, while the female takes care of the fertilized eggs until they hatch, after which she also kicks the bucket. Oh, and one more thing, all octopuses are venomous, but only the blue-ringed ones are deadly to humans. So if you ever come across a blue-ringed octopus, don't mess with it. Next are the squids, which also contain three hearts. You know what they say, squid happens. These little mollusks with their elongated soft bodies, eight arms and two tentacles might not strictly fit the criteria of being true squid, but they're still pretty cool. They're like the James Bond of the sea, playing an important role as open water predators and using their jet propulsion to swiftly move through the water. And just like 007, they're pretty intelligent too, with some Humboldt squid even hunting cooperatively like a secret agent team. But even with all their cool gadgets and smarts, they still end up as prey for sharks, sea birds, and even giant sperm whales. So, they've developed their own incredible defense mechanism of ejecting a cloud of ink to distract their predators. And let's not forget how delicious they are, squid are used for human consumption all over the world, often known as calamari. So next time you're enjoying some calamari, just remember that you're munching on a little underwater secret agent. Another animal with three hearts is the cuttlefish. Have you heard about the cuttlefish? They're like the cool kids of the marine mollusk world, part of the cephalopoda class, which includes the popular squid and octopuses, but they have something extra special, an internal shell called the cuttlebone. It's like their own personal flotation device, with their W-shaped pupils, eight arms, and two tentacles with sucker teeth, cuttlefish are built for success in the ocean. They'll eat just about anything that crosses their path, from small mollusks and crabs to fish and even other cuttlefish. Of course, they have their own share of predators, dolphins, sharks, seals, and even other cuttlefish have been known to take them down. But don't let their short life expectancy fool you, cuttlefish are some of the smartest invertebrates out there, with brains that put most other invertebrates to shame. In fact, they've got one of the biggest brain-to-body size ratios around. So watch out, world, the cuttlefish are coming. If three hearts left you speechless, how about four? Hagfish, also known as slime eels, are like the greasy cousin of the fish family. They look like eels, but they are not true eels. They produce massive amounts of slime to defend themselves from predators, which is impressive but also kind of gross. Despite having a skull, they are the only known living creatures that don't have a proper backbone. They do have some sad-looking little vertebrae, though. They are also jawless, which makes them the outcasts of the fish world. Scientists used to argue whether hagfish were the weird cousins of vertebrates or a primitive form of life. That came before the backbone evolved. 
Nowadays, DNA evidence seems to confirm that they are the oddball cousins of lampreys. On top of our list with five hearts are the earthworms. Let's take a jab at this one, earthworms are the ultimate underground recyclers. These tube-shaped critters belong to the phylum Anelida and have CD on all segments and a body plan that looks like a tube within a tube. You can find them all over the world, as long as there's soil, water, and a decent temperature. Their digestive system runs through their whole body, and they can eat just about anything organic, from plant matter to tiny living organisms like protozoa, rotifers, nematodes, bacteria, fungi, and more. They breathe through their skin and have a coelomic fluid transport system that moves around in a hydrostatic skeleton. Despite not having a skeleton, earthworms can maintain their body shape with the help of fluid-filled coelom chambers. They have a central and peripheral nervous system, and chemoreceptors are concentrated near their mouths. When they want to move, they use a combination of circumferential and longitudinal muscles, edging each body segment. But what about romance, you ask? Earthworms are hermaphrodites. They carry both male and female reproductive organs and fertilize each other's eggs during mating. How convenient! And if you want to impress your friends with your knowledge of earthworms, they're also known as dewworms, rainworms, nightcrawlers, or angleworms, if you're using them as bait for fishing. So there you have it, folks, the ultimate soil superheroes. But wait, there's more. The following creatures don't actually have numerous hearts in the same way, but I still included them in the list. Have you ever heard of humans with two hearts? A human is naturally born with one heart but there are cases of conjoined twins where two hearts have been found. Another case is for a medical condition called cardiomyopathy, when a heart transplant is needed. The surgeons graft another heart into the patient's own, thus giving them two hearts. How about horses? Have you heard they have five hearts? Well, kind of. Like other mammals, horses only have one heart. But with every step a horse takes, the frog in each hoof functions as a pump to push blood back up the leg. The frog serves as a shock absorber in addition. Naturally, this is the situation when the hooves are in their barefoot state. The hoof enlarges and is filled with blood when it is placed on the ground. As soon as it is grasped, it contracts, sending the blood back up the hoof to the heart. Every 20 steps, about a liter of blood, is pumped through the body. Therefore, a horse has five hearts since each hoof is a heart. The last one on our list has 13 hearts. You may call them pests, but hey, they are so popular among women because, when they're around, you would hear them screaming like they just saw their favorite movie star. Do you now have any idea what animal it is? It's the cockroaches. Well, experts say it's just one heart with 13 chambers. Unlike human hearts, which have four separate chambers that serve one of two purposes, all the heart chambers in a cockroach serve the same purpose, and instead of oxygen, the blood that circulates within the heart's chambers delivers nutrients throughout the body. Cockroaches may be our least favorite bug, but we can't help but admire their tenacity and adaptability. Their love for dark, damp places and their tendency to munch on just about anything. Seriously, they'll eat anything from leftover pizza to the glue on the back of postage stamps. And don't even get us started on the fact that they can survive for a month without food or water. Talk about resilience. Plus, they make for great horror movie villains. Just don't be surprised if you find them scurrying around your kitchen in the middle of the night. And that is all. What do you think of today's video? Are these weird, interesting, or fun facts? Please leave a comment down below, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please click the subscribe and like buttons so you will be notified of my next video.